Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we're playing with Mad Dijin. You're up in Rosalus 4 multiplayer, busting the HRE. Say hi, Mad Jin. Hey. This could be the last episode, it's possible. It really depends on whether or not my king dies. If my king would we, just die. I think we said that last episode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good times. Oh, yeah. So, right. um, you ready? Yep. Okay. I'm just mass producing units. Yep. We've got 20, 28 per turn. I ordered Doing some okay trade ships to be built. Or month. Or so month, hopefully those whatever. will come in soon. I should be finding the cheaper places to build things. There's one. <sighs> so I'm up to 67 units. That's a lot of units. Uh, only 40 more to go. <laughs> Never enough units, are there? Never. Although my manpower is maxing out at 120k. Oh, never mind. <laughs> like, my manpower is not going to be able to deal with it. Never mind. Oh, hey, Celestia just left my coalition. Yep. They're my vassal. Oh, beat up. oh you just vassaled Celestia? Yep. <laughs> Everyone wants to be a vassal right now. It's great. I was gonna kill them. Uh, Bohemia. Same thing. I was gonna give it everything to Bohemia. As long as they're not independent, right? No, Bohemia needs their lands back. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. Yes, it does. Um. A vessel of Burgundy, it's a vassal of Burgundy. So is Platinate the like the only one left in there? That's not uh, a vassal of somebody? Palatinate and Austria. Yeah, well Baden. And uh Baden's also theirs. So, oh, Ulm is allied with Denmark. Oh, and the Hansa. You're guaranteeing their independence. Oh, don't worry about the Hansa. Are you gonna soak them? They're about to vassalize, yep. Alright, good enough. Oh, and Oldenburg is a vassal of Austria. Yeah, for some reason, they've had Oldenburg and Anschbach as vassals for like a hundred years. And just never soaked them. Yeah, they just won't. They're just wasting their diplomatic points on it for some reason. Okay, Hansa is vassal. Uh, how far are you on the Teutons? Uh, it's just going to be insanely long. Uh, they're not actually part of the HRE, so we don't have to care about it. Okay. I'm at negative 138 because their overlord abandoned us problem. What about Riga? Uh, I should have them... Well, that'll be a while. Uh, I'm improving relations at the moment. Mm. So I'll have them soon enough. Oh, yeah, no, Croatia decided to hate me. Uh, they probably have Bosnia as a rival. They yeah, no, they have okay. they have Serbia as a rival. I don't yeah, know. Both vassals of you. Yeah, so why, really why do they hate each other? Vassals should not hate each other. I mean, what's the point? Uh oh, Spain's at war with someone. Spain's at war with Venice, Wallachia, Castile, France, and Switzerland. Oh God, France is gonna die. <laughs> and Bohemia is part of that war. Bye, France. Or Bosnia, sorry, is part of that war. Oh, you haven't vassalized yeah. Bosnia yet? I can't, uh, target country must be at peace. Yeah, but I thought... Sorry. Right, 150 I, at the moment. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you had already grabbed them. No, not yet. Ooh, Austria vassalized Württemberg. Damn it, Austria. Land maintenance modifier, minus 10%. Do I want it? No, I want the tech. Need to get to level 17. Military tech? Yeah. Yeah. I'm working on that too. Defender of the faith? Why I never. Okay. Did somebody? Go, did you take it or? No, it's it. The little pop up just came up. Like you should take defender of the faith. I'm like, no. Get free morale. Eh. All right, I think I've got sufficient. I've I've still got army force limit to go, but 
but... I'm at... Well, no, I might as well finish it off. I'm very close. Getting there. Oh, trade ships are done. Trade 99. ships. <sighs> hey, my king finally died. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause, 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 pause. So we now have Savoy as the emperor. Lulz. And they disallowed internal HRE wars. Who right cares? Who cares? That's funny. This, they did it right off the mark. Okay. This is funny. Oh, I'll take your word for it. It's funny. Ha ha. Uh huh. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. All right, so we finally have an emperor that's not you. And let's see, who are they allied with? Who can we get into war like super easily? They're allied with France. So I could just declare war on France. But that would bring in Denmark. I'd prefer not to have Denmark. Who else would it be? Uh, the he Pope. He's allied with France, Austria, Pelin, uh, Platinet. Aragon, Castile, Portugal, and the Papal State. Basically. Just declare war on the Pope. Over there. The Pope's only allied with three dudes. Yeah. Although Austria would probably become the war leader, and that would bring in Hungary and Britain. Hmm. Yeah. Unless I declare war on Austria first. Actually, Britain will join me in the war against the Pope. So let me just do that. Okay, we are now at okay, war wait, with the Pope. Wait. Don't unpause. Because uh, I can bring in Bosnia, Riga, and Castile versus Austria. Not Hungary, though. Unfortunately. Uh, but I can bring in Castile versus Austria. Oh, Castile's already fighting France. Mm-hmm. So there's no way Austria could so bring them in. Hold on. Mm-hmm. Uh, do, 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 do. Well, it's just Ferrara, right? They're your vassal? That's the only elector, yeah. And I can okay. cancel their vassalization, I guess. Yeah. You can do that. Oh, I can't do it while they're at war. Well, never mind. I'll do it after the war. Oh, we don't even need to. If they're my vassal, all I have to do is go invade Savoy and then game over, right? I guess. Savoy's capital is Piedmont. He has 16 units there. That's his entire army. Well, I have like 100 units. Enjoy. Yep. Ready to unpause? Yeah, uh, Savoy's actually got a couple more units there, but nothing special. Ah, I'm not worried about it. Okay, unpause. Let's do this thing! Also, okay. I just wanted enough time to get the last couple of guys. Okay, let's see what the whole war is. The whole war is Savoy, Austria, the Pope, Anschbach, Oldenburg, Württemberg, and Switzerland. Who cares? So far, so good. Yeah, let's see if Portugal wants in. Oh, they don't want in. Why not? Oh, they're allied with my enemy. Oh, but Portugal did not join against me in the war. Just wait for it. Oh, you think they'll join? <laughs> Well, Britain joined on my side, so that's nice. Ah, whatever. Let's just unpause. Okay. Oh, Portugal did join against me. Damn. Nah, nah, nah. Okay. Let me pause up here. I have so many units here. Uh, let's go invade Savoy. And you clowns shall go here. Yes. Okay, unpause. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to get my stability back up. There we go. Unpause. Yeah, I'm floating at plus three right now. I'm oh, good. Don't mind me as I mess. Except military access. Oh no, Portugal's beating up my vassal. Yeah, let's see if we can get all this done quickly. Okay, I'm now standing in Savoy's capital. 
I think that's all I have to do. But I want to play too. <laughs> well, you can come in. You can do whatever. Oh, I can do whatever? So yeah. I can beat up a uh, little uh, Celestia? Just go do really whatever. Bad. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Ooh, you're awesome. Oh, okay, those guys are on the wrong place. Never mind. Um, who do I want to beat up? Even France joined against me. Yeah. So this is my war. Actually, it's not that big, but that is a lot of units. I mean, if they all came at the same time. Oh, Hungary went and joined Austria against me. Aww. Sponsor the university or do nothing. All right. Another loan incoming. I like these leaders I'm getting. Hmm. <laughs> oh, talking about leaders, I, oh, I wow. can make my king a leader. My king is 64. That's how long my other king lived. His heir was 64 when he took over. My goodness. Yeah, I've got a fire six guy. They're so cute. <laughs> Hungry is often wandering. You gonna get into a fight here? I don't think so. Just a few points away from military tech 16. I really want that. Or 17. I really want it. I'm a little bit away, but not too bad. Yeah, I think I can hit this button real soon here. <laughs> this could be it. <laughs> no, not it. Spain is currently beating the hell out of France, which is good because that means France not going to fight me. They don't care. I'm gonna slurp my coffee. Slurp it. <sighs> All right, I should get up there into that fight. Austria has seemed to completely left their homelands alone. They're over here with ten troops just wandering around doing nothing. Yeah, it might be the mass of troops I've got sitting on their homelands. You made them evacuate? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I left one province, but whatever. But no, Muscovy's picking on Tiver. I'm just trying to catch all the Hungarian armies. It kind of sucks that you wound up at war with them. After all they've been through with you. Mm -hmm. After all they've been through, they backed Austria in the end. Did it say yes on the little checkbox? No. Uh, it was going to say no. In the uh, They were going to go no. Mm. I knew that was going to happen. Because it's a defensive war. Yeah. Therefore. They're just always more likely to join the defense. Yep. It's unfortunate. Integration is a slow process. Hey, who'd you get? Somebody. But, ooh, Aragon or somebody sent... Hold on, let me pause for a second. I need to see. I need to stop and look at what's going on here. Uh, there is Oldenburg, Württemberg, Ansbach, and Savoy. You're not doing a good job with Savoy if their armies are over here. <laughs> hmm. Well, they're not fighting me. Yeah, no, they're bugging me. Where are they? Uh, over in Austria. <laughs> oh, Savoy's the leader of your war, too. What the hell? Oh, wow, well, they did, too. <laughs> stupid. Oh, that means... That means they're gonna bring in all their stupid allies. Portugal and all that junk. Nope. They didn't. 
Uh, I got Castile in my side, so if uh, Portugal joined, Castile would just run him over. Oh my goodness. Military Tax 17 gives supply limit plus 50%. Really? Wow. Where? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. That's amazing. Well, all of them do. Every single time you hit levels, it's plus 50%. Is it? Are you sure? Yeah, level yeah, looking at it. Level 5, 50%. Level 12, 50%. Level 17, 50%. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not every level. I thought it was every level. You know, like, what? No, every level it goes up. Yeah. And it's, like, grouped. So, a little bit here, a little bit there. Um, I'm probably going to have to merge some of these armies together. Rather than let them all get squished. Although Portugal's uh, sitting on top of Austria for some reason. Portugal's got 27 guys here and they're not at war with me. Alright, let's go. Integration is a slow process. Boink! You guys should probably not be here. Everybody go there. Go there. Somebody took Defender of the Catholic Faith. Yeah, I did. For the extra morale. Alright. I still won that fight. Actually, I really should send these guys over here. Ah, oh, man, playing this without pausing to be able to move stuff is very... Just pause. It's fine. All good. You can do it. Sort of. Except for all these freaking pop-ups. Hold on. Hey! We have dismantled the Holy Roman Empire, which gives us 100 prestige. The Holy Roman Empire has been dismantled by Dot. Period. When the Holy Roman Empire disman gets dismantled by us, open a pop-up window. How about you pop up and pause? That's kind of a big event. It is kind of a big event. I was trying to pause at the same time. All right, so that that's that. Now it's, what? Uh, by dot. <laughs> so if I click on the Holy Roman in the Imperial map mode, everything's gray. There is no green. <laughs> Actually, click on the Imperial map mode and look at green. You have to zoom out. Where's the Imperial one? Oh, that one. Um, okay. So, Narin? All the wastelands are green? All the wastelands and a lot of colonies. Are all green. Yeah, for some reason. So that's the Empire now. <laughs> the, the Empire is all the areas that have not been colonized. Or can't be. Oh, lovely. Hey, good times, man. Good, Good times. times. One last big fight to win it all. Winner takes all? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm still squishing these guys. Um, yeah, Savoy's kind of toast. Austria's about to be toast. How many princes did we have left? 22. Your, yes, give or take. Well, I just soaked in two, so... So, 20. And, um, and all the various vassals that you already had. I have so many prince vassals, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I've got a couple. I still have Bohemia to soak. The weird Noble Republic Bohemia. Noble Republic? They are. Oh, wow. <laughs> noble. The Noble Republic of Bohemia. Um, so, yeah, we could still soak. And Austria, Styria were the last two big ones, I guess. Because Milan's not uh, HRE. Oh, actually, that's an interesting thing. Milan's not HRE. Oh, never mind. It's not that interesting. I was going to say, they're not part of the HRE, but they were. Uh, all their lands lost the HRE number. Or the flag. Yep. You can't even reform it. I'm not surprised. <laughs> it took so much effort to get rid of it. Uh, all right. Uh, so I guess that's it then. Oh, and uh, just for kicks, here is uh, Military Tech 17. Hey, good job. Uh, Diplo Tech 17 and <laughs> Admin Tech 16.
Naval oh, glory. I'm going to take a naval idea. There we go. Prestige from naval battles, plus 100%. Fantastic. Uh, we can get Blasphemous, even. Oh, and the School Establishment Act. Except for the build cost. I don't like that 3% boost, but... Ah, it's worth it. And the production efficiency and the stability cost modifier are going down. But you lose tax and stuff like that. All right. Well, um, I guess we're done. Yeah, that was good. I'm gonna save here. We, we broke. Totally the, around. We broke the HRE. Yep, you've been busted. <laughs> I can't believe he went from voting for Styria to voting for Austria to voting for someone as dumb as Savoy. I mean, what's the point of voting for Savoy? They had what, 15 units or something? Come on. Yeah. <laughs> You're all done. I'm surprised he didn't vote for someone like Milan, who's huge. Yeah. Oh well, what are you going to do? That's okay. Um, apparently I've got 1,900 manpower each month now. Somehow. <laughs> Probably some buildings <laughs> finished or something. No, I, I was already done them. Do you get manpower from conquered provinces, like the stuff you have in Hungary? I don't know. There was a change in the re one of the recent patches where you start getting stuff from if you like if you see Joe production. Place, you start getting their production and yeah. some other stuff. Maybe you get the manpower. Yeah, that would be a little odd, but possible. <laughs> oh, manpower! Manpower efficiency on this place is eighty-seven <laughs> percent. What's that mean? Uh, it negatives. Not accepted. Blah blah blah. Uh, basically. Manpower is uh, 58 on this place, even though it's base 1000 and base factor is 0 0.017. Okay. I don't know, it's just really tiny compared to what it could be. Right. Uh, whereas other places... I don't know, I guess it's not too bad. Eh, whatever. Anyways, we have busted the HREs. We have Nothing. busted the HRE. Uh, the Ottomans... Actually, the Ottomans failed up a little bit here. They wiped out the Mamluks, but the Mamluks seem to have come back. Yeah, the Mamluks came back. I don't remember why they came back. They came back, and Georgia's doing okay over there. I'm surprised to see Georgia in 1614. Yeah, they're still alive. And Muscovy has not annexed Perm yet. Oh, they lost uh, their no, union! They lost their, yeah, Ooh. They lost the perm loves me. I could have, uh... Played nice with the perm. Ah, whatever. Japan yeah, is invading. Good. Japan is invading the Manchu. Go Japan. Yeah, that's pretty <laughs> standard. All right, I'm gonna go to um, fog of war. Oh, I can't do that. Yep. I can't turn on fog of war. What about uh, observe mode? I can't do that either. Damn it! Aww. Yeah, it looks like Great Britain took uh, a lot of the coast. Delaware oh, wow! Cabot Strait over there. Yep. And a lot of the Caribbean islands, too. Nobody's in uh, Cuba yet. Yeah, what's with no Cuba? Cuba. I'm surprised France Cuba. is not colonizing. I don't know. They get they have one idea where they get less uh, native stuff, but they tend not to colonize till a little later. Now, granted, you keep beating them up. They have exploration, too. So they have... That's in, that includes quests for the New World. So they yeah. haven't... I don't know what they're not doing. And they can see everything that I can see. I mean, I'm Western, so they can see all this stuff. They're just not doing it. Yeah. I don't know. You're probably beating them up too much. <laughs> and I'm not even doing it now. Now it's Castile. Oh, looks like Portugal ate the Congo, except for one spot. Yeah, I saw that pop instead up. Of just, instead of just bouncing through, they just... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Benin, though. Benin's pretty big on that corner. Yep, and they are animists. You can just go in there and annex the hell out of them. Yeah, yoink. Well, I guess we're done. Yep, I think we can high five there, somewhere in northern okay. Germany. <laughs> oh, and uh, Hanoverian didn't become acceptable yet, unfortunately. Really? Even though you have a ton of it? Yeah. Oh, you soaked in um, Saxe Lauenburg, yeah. Yeah. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six. So you have six Hanoverian provinces, but that's not enough. Well, I guess, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you well, need I, a I, lot. If I boosted up their tax and other such things. It would still take some time, though, yeah. Yeah. 
Um, or to actually take Hanover and uh, Oldenburg. I think you have to take a good chunk of it to really get it. Well, it has to be 20% of your income, right? Yeah. That's the that's the minimum threshold for it to activate the green accepted. But then if it drops below 20%, it doesn't go away. It has to drop below 10% for it to go away. So it stays accepted for a long time. Yep. Anyway, yeah, I think that's good. That was fun. And the HRE is gone. Lovely. Like dinner. That's beautiful. And I guess that means I can't do a Lithuania game for a while. <laughs> it also means if you ever want to bust the HRE in the future, you, aren't, you at least know how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think we were doing okay, except that we split up the vassals, and it wasn't, it wasn't you know... All of the voters were vassaled by any random person. It was. It has to be the to be same wanted. person. Isn't that dumb? It really should just be anyone, yeah. Like, they're, they're not able to be electors, so, yeah. Uh, oh, well. Oh, well. It, it worked. worked. We bro broke Austria. Oh, poor Austria. You did that. You made him spit out Silesia. That was huge. Oh, you mean Styria. Yeah, or Styria, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, broke Muscovy, sort of. Ah, you did. <laughs> For a little bit. You did, but then you lost focus. You let them regather, right? They got steam yeah. again. Although Crimea is uh, up above Muscova. That now. is so funny. They're, they're uh, doing some damage. But yeah, we're good. <laughs> Ottomans didn't get very far. No, they barely did anything. It's 1614 and the Ottomans have barely done anything at all. Well, other than beat up the Mamluks. Yeah, but they always do that. Yeah, they don't always do it, but I've only seen once or twice where the Ottomans will push into Serbia, Bosnia, towards Hungary. Mm. Like, they just don't seem to have any go into Europe. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have your go into Europe this morning? Hmm. Num num. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's been fun. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been Shen. And I've been some guy. Some guy. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.